done, you son of a bitch. Yo, what's going on guys? It's Dylan, and I'm back with another trailer reaction video. Now today, obviously you could tell from the thumbnail, we're going to be doing a trailer reaction video for the new Morbius trailer. Got up pretty early today, and I uh, was wondering when the hell this thing was going to drop. It's finally here, so let's just jump right into this, man. I mean... You know, I was talking a little bit with some of the people in the community, you know, not too many people were that big of a fan of Jared Leto's Joker. Uh, it wasn't horrible, but there was a lot of aspects a lot of us in the community weren't feeling. So let's see what he, let's see what, what's going to happen with him doing a Marvel title. So this one I've been really anticipating because you guys know I'm a big horror fan. So let's jump right into this and you know, I'm going to probably run this back. So let's, uh. Start this up now. Michael, I've known you since you were a child. <clears throat> you always have. There's an answer to the disease. You'll find it. Hmm. I didn't know Morbius was on the crutches. Oh, damn. I wonder who's that girl? At what cost? At any cost. Yo, that girl though. Wow, though, he looks really skinny. The ability to use echolocation. Hmm. And overpowering words to consume blood. How far are we allowed to go? To go fix something that's broken. Is worse than the disease. Yo, so that was like that fucking picture they leaked last night was like the only thing a Morbius would really get. What the fuck? Michael Keaton? Damn, I didn't know he was in that shit. I mean, I don't know, man. I'm a. I don't know that much about Morbius, but uh, I've been I've been reading his most recent Morbius: The Living Vampire, run by Vita Alea. I don't know, man. I guess this is more of like that origin story, no doubt. Um, the one I'm reading, he's already a vampire, so. I don't know, man. I hope I hope we get more of him in that vampire form, but dude, it's like I guess it, it is just a teaser trailer. Yeah, I didn't I didn't notice that. I, I forgot it's just a teaser trailer. So obviously they're gonna hold out on the uh, hold out on the big guns, but I have a feeling. I mean, just the way that he looks with that CGI, I have a feeling, man. They're not really gonna use that like the form as much as we probably want i mean a lot of jared leto he looks skinny as fuck i wonder how skinny like if he really got skinny 
for that role because he goes from skinny to looking buff as fuck, dude. But, um, yeah, honestly, man, I got to run that back because it's so, it's hard for me to pull in all that at, at once, man. It's a, uh, it was a cool trailer though. It was cool. Um, I want to see, I definitely want to, I definitely will be checking it out, but let's run this back one more time, man. And go. And his eyes, like, I don't know, his eyes look. Like all white with a little, like some black stars or something. I don't fucking know. I don't think he, yeah, I, I bet you that's CGI or something, man. Maybe not, though. I mean, he is a, he's gotten skinny as hell for other roles, so. So I wonder where he goes though when he like takes this helicopter. They really using that, they're bringing that far from home and homecoming. Like, nah, bruh. You mean the rights. Look at that purple. Tyrese Gibson. Yeah, I haven't seen nothing that connects Spider-Man to this shit, though. What's up, Doc? I don't know what the fuck that's supposed to mean. Maybe that's something from the comics. Yeah, man, I... I mean, I'll be watching it. No doubt. I mean, it, it's got the horror vibes, no doubt, but, uh... I want to I want I want it to go, like, full-on horror. Full-on. So, we'll see what happens. Uh, I'm excited for it. I'm excited. Uh, I don't... You know, it's a teaser trailer. Wait, you know, if they gave everything away, I'd be, I'd be kind of pissed. But it's like it leaves you, it leaves me wanting more. So that's good. You know what I'm saying? If it leaves me wanting more, I think it, it did its job as a teaser trailer. Uh, I like Jared Leto for this role. I like him. When they announced him, I thought I'm like, now nah, that 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 I can see him in. The Joker was always. I was excited because the man just won a, an Oscar. So I was like, oh, they're going in down that Heath Ledger role. Maybe because we got a real good actor, um, you know, playing the Joker. We're not talking about the Joker, but uh, yeah, I'm excited for it. I I hope this is a great movie. You you see Sony, man, they're the studio that brought you Homecoming and Far From Home. It's like, dude, you didn't fucking bring us that, man. You just let M the MCU have the rights for a movie, man. Like, come on, bro. They're milking the fuck out that shit. Yo, man, I'm tripping, dude. I, uh, my dumb ass going like, yo, I didn't see nothing that tied in to the, uh, Spider-Man and, uh, Morbius. But as he's walking out with that, uh, you know, county jail looking uniform, looking like he just escaped from prison or something, you see the damn murderer Spider-Man poster behind him, dude. 
I run it back to back for these reasons, and I ain't see that shit. What the fuck am I doing, bro? But I went and I'm watching it for the third time, and I'm like, holy shit. I got to add that before someone in the comments is like, you fucking retard, man. Did you not see it? You watched it twice. Um, but yeah, I caught that. So it does look like they tied it in, which is pretty amazing. I actually was just reading that. That uh, they were talking like he was supposed to, um, like J.J., uh, J. Jonah Jameson was actually going to uh, be interviewing uh, Michael Morbius in the movie. So I wonder if that's still going to happen. They said that that was going to be in the trailer, but we didn't see that. But we did see a Spider-Man poster with the word murderer. So, holy shit, bro. This ties into after Far From Home. So it makes sense now why they're using the the studios that brought you Homecoming and Far From Home in the tagline. Damn, bro. That's crazy. So what's that mean? Have they finally done it? Have they finally connected the Sony-verse with the MCU? I don't know, man, but I just had to throw that in there. So, dude, crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Yeah, though, I'm excited for it. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys are thinking. I'm going to probably go watch this trailer a couple more times. But, you know what I'm saying? We can't add five trailers into one. But back-to-back -back is good enough. Um, I hope you enjoy this. I know this one. I was really taking this one in. Because uh, I don't know that much about Morbius. Like, I know the specifics. I know, you know, he's a scientific vamp, scientific-made vampire. But I honestly don't even know the origin of him that much. So, like, when I see him putting his hand up to that, like those wires and the bats coming to him that's all new to me i don't even know if that's straight from the comics that could be something that they kind of did i don't know if he's in transylvania when he goes there but uh i'm interested no doubt i'm a big horror fan you know i like vampires i love dracula i love the wolfman all those classic shit so i'm, I'm excited to see what's gonna go down so let me know in the comments down below what you guys are thinking i'm really interested to know what big more big time morbius fans are thinking about this my homie g-man uh comic book g-spot uh i'm definitely wondering what you're thinking i'm gonna have to go message you on ig and see what you're thinking of this because my man right there he's the big time morbius fan so if it if it ain't up to par with him man uh i don't know but uh yeah make sure you guys hit that like button on your way out if you're not subscribed hit that subscribe button Hit that bell notification and be on the lookout for all upcoming videos. And yeah, I'll catch you on the next one, guys. Peace out.